RCA, they believe in me. And one thing that RCA does, which is great, which labels don't do, is they allow artists to be themselves and do what they want, what the fuck they want to do, mm -hmm. you know? And um, RCA allowed me to do what I wanted with this album. And I didn't get the big label push on 1984. It's more of like my shit. But surprisingly, I put it out. And, and it's killing it. It's killing. And it's like the people are losing their minds, man. People, it's a, it's, you know? I feel like it's a cleansing of, 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 of uh, everyone's <laughs> palate sonically. We were I talking about that off the camera, just like with, with what's going on in the world. Clubs aren't going on. Yeah. There's yeah. like people are looking for like music to sit with. Exactly. Like, dude, like if I were to die this shit would be, like, my big one. You understand? Like, if I'm gone, like, in no exaggeration, if I'm, something happens to me, this album is going to be legendary, classic, timeless, iconic. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And and if you're not, if you don't feel like that about your project, then you shouldn't put it out. That's fair. And this is not me bragging about me. This is me having, this is me with Rolling Stone magazine interviews, uh, Forbes, Doing, doing some of the greatest, biggest interviews with some of the most relevant interviewers of all time that have, have, have interviewed icons telling me this is an iconic album. So it's so the way I feel about it, it's through the people telling me, not me telling myself. You know what I'm saying? I can't toot my own horn. That only could get me as far as getting me somewhere. But when the people that have the right credentials tell you, yo, this is, this is an incredible project, then... It kind of makes you, you know, this is, okay, I was saying, Stairs album, which is my mm -hmm. first one, is my late registration. Okay. Or College Dropout. I was going to say that's Kanye's second album, but okay. No, but <laughs> no, because I have four play. Okay. Yeah, yeah, true, true, true. So that's my. And you had a lot of singles. That's and, my, yeah, yeah, that's my College Dropout, four play. And my late registration is Stairs. And we'll just skip a few Kanye albums. And um, Gashi is my graduation. This is your 808s. This is my 808s. Changing 18. changing music. Exactly. Because 808s did change music. Exactly. This is my eight. This is my 808s. Yeah, I would say 808s and Yeezus are two like albums Kanye put out that just sonically changed like the direction of like hip hop or music. Yeah, and my my tw my dog was fancy as well. Yeah, of, of course, of course. I just mean in terms of like like sound. Sound. Yes, yes. You know what I mean? Like, I agree. I agree. And uh, my next one. My next album is going to be my, my, um, my, my, my Dark Twisted Fantasy, mine, my version. Fire. And then after that is going to be, um, my Jesus. And then you don't know where I'm going to go with it, but I just the thing is the key is to never make the same song twice. That's N never make the same sounding album. I always wanted to make my shit sound like I want to make. When I'm in the world, was in the theme, I'm in the theme. My next project, I want it to feel like '90s dance music, you know. Okay. Like I want it to feel like a gay club. Like that's how I want my music to feel. Like I want it to feel like. Shout out to all my gay fans too. Like they, they shout out. Yo, know, shout out to all my gay fans. Like, like they have some of the most incredible taste ever, ever, and they put me on all the time. Like listen to this, listen to that, and I kind of like, like I like I appreciate how like how much love I get not from everyone, but so sonically you want to go and like, I'm just, when I think of like what you just said, I don't know why night of the Roxbury just popped in my head. <laughs> yeah. 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 That's, that's true. Night, night at the Roxbury, like those kind of vibes. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like Ace, Ace bro, like that's, that's the fucking, that's if the you vibe. You can pull the, uh, the Will <laughs> Ferrell or what, what's the other guy's name? The, the tiny guy. Something can. I don't know. He's locked up. Uh, yeah. Oh, is he? I think so. Yeah. Damn. That'd be crazy um, if you get that. But man, like, bro, like, we're not here forever, man. You know, like, do what you love, bro. Like, people. I swear, if you see how fast people move on after somebody dies in 2020, you think twice before thinking about what someone else is gonna say about you. 